And right now at 4.30, hundreds of women say the popular WEN hair care products made their hair fall out. But for the first time, we're learning the ingredients in WEN that attorney says are causing the problems. It's an update to a consumer justice investigation we brought to you last year. Our Kristen Severance joins us live in Dallas with the brand new details. Kristen? Guys, I'm sure you've seen these commercials and infomercials. WEN claims to use natural, plant based ingredients. But these newly filed documents claim that synthetic allergens are in the product and that may cause hair loss. Why are you not using WEN? The celebrity backed WEN hair care products have been at the center of a class action lawsuit for the last year. Susan Browning of Dallas and hundreds of others say using it made them go bald. In the shower, when I'd squeeze the water out of my hair, I'd, I'd have handfuls of hair coming out. A judge gave preliminary approval to a $26.5 million settlement in the case. And it looks like they had a weed whacker taken to their head. But Amy Davis, one of the lawyers for the plaintiffs, just filed an objection to that settlement. It states the ingredients used in WEN do not use all natural products like it suggests in the infomercials. It alleges that chemicals like cathon and HICC are used, and these chemicals are known allergens, which can cause red, itchy, flaky, and blistered scalps in some people. It says in severe cases, it can trigger hair loss. Contains virtually no cleanser. It's basically like bathing in lotion. The FDA is also investigating reports of hair loss caused by when. There were at least 1,386 complaints through November of last year, and 21,000 complaints reported directly to Chaz Dean and Guthy Ranker. WEN has always maintained its product does not cause hair loss. They told us in a statement, there are many reasons why individuals may lose their hair, all unrelated to WEN hair care products. We're expecting more filings on this case soon. Of course, we'll keep you updated. Live in Dallas, I'm consumer justice investigator Kristen Severance, CBS 11 News.